I'm going to show you how to create a radial array in Blender that can be useful for creating objects like this flower starting right now. So right now I have this mesh that I made in Blender 2.8 and you can see that it kind of resembles a flower petal. You can also see that it is a little bit offset from the center axis. To create our radial array, we will first of all create an empty. So we'll go to add and we'll go to empty and we'll hit on plane axis. Now we will click on our mesh, we'll click on add modifiers, and we will click on array. In here, we want to click on the offset, turn off relative offset, pump up the numbers, we'll do 24. And now we'll go down to object offset and click on the eyedropper and select your empty. Now it doesn't appear like anything happened, but it did. Now we'll want to actually click our empty and rotate it. And we can hold down shift to slow that rotation down. And now we have a nice little start to our flower. You can do other things with our radial array, like create a staircase. Or maybe you wanted to create a barrel, like I am going to be working on in my upcoming videos. Really, really rough barrel, but that's how I would I would start out the barrel to so I could sculpt each piece individually. Don't forget to like and subscribe. If you have any questions or would like to see a video on a specific topic, please comment below. I'm here to help you in your art journey. Thanks for watching that video, and I'll see you next time.